<laughs> Diarrhea. <laughs> Diarrhea. <laughs> oh, also, I didn't explain this to you earlier, but we just straight up have a creeper mob farm over here that's generating infinite catalyzing glands, gunpowder, and fire shards. So if you ever need any of those, uh, just take it from the uh, grinder. I feel like you have created a monstrosity, and I, I wish not to take part in it. Oh, I have. If I had more space, which we do now, um, these things would be infinitely more powerful. I don't want you to remove the shaft. I like the shaft. Well, I'm removing my shaft, because part of me would be happier without it. But we don't talk about Bruno. Where's the flattener? Where, where, where do I flatten my brass? Okay, so do you know uh, the the weird pounding mallet thing I showed you? I showed you what it's uh, it's that. Think, think. Hold on, I'm I'm I'm, I'm uh, a second inscriber. Right then, so oh, now, oh, now that I have the inscribers, cool. I can, can put them. One inscriber in the air, in the air over here. We can use Vintium as our building block. And then the other one can go here, like so. I don't think I need a second one, but it's better to have a second one and not need it than to not have a second one and uh, not have it. What I need in order to make the 4K storage component is the 1Ks, which we have plenty of, quartz glass, which we can get from an EMC um, machine, and a calculation processor, which is a printed calculation circuit, which comes from pure Certus Quartz crystals and an inscriber calculation press. So I need the inscriber calculation press, which I believe I left downstairs, and some pure Certus Quartz crystals. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. The server's so laggy, I just fell through my elevator. Donia, Donia is getting destroyed. Oh, yeah. This is not oh, good yeah. at all. Oh, honestly, I think I'm. I think I think I might accidentally delete the game folders. You know. <laughs> no, not episode forty-three of Shadow. I mean, of of Umbra of Marta. Oh no, we we lost the world, oh, guys. No. We we lost. Guys, the world. I guess we have to go do a more successful project <laughs> that was more thought out. Yeah, and a lot more fun <laughs> in the long run and had less of an emphasis on law. Since the inscriber calculation press is renewable, the only thing I need now is the pure Certus Quartz crystal. Now that comes from putting uh, Certus Quartz dust through an enrichment chamber, but to get the dust we have to crush it, and we can crush it through many things. But of all the things that we can crush it with, we already have a crusher within this series of things up here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take this crusher. crusher. I'm gonna find a way to wire it into the mainframe uh, from the downstairs room. And I'm just gonna I'm just gonna include it as part of the pipeline because it's better than leaving it on the wall over here where it's just sort of out of place. Yeah, of course. And unloved. <clears throat> is that your voice? Growgriff, is that you? That's my impression of 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 your mother. <laughs> I'm getting a back blow now. Um, excuse me, my mother uh, sounds more like. <laughs> <laughs> I said a back blown out, not a throat being bruised. You just <coughs> choked yourself with that, didn't you? Maybe, maybe, maybe. Okay, so now that I've got the crusher, I need the enrichment chamber. So give me this. Give me the enrichment chamber. Why does the enrichment chamber sound like something not very enriching? It sounds like something you'd go to work and they would introduce you to. It's like, oh yeah, I know you've just been speaking. Oh, 100%. Up. It sounds like you've been speaking out of term to, of company values. Do you want to go to the enrichment chamber and it's just like HR with a bunch of whips and paddles about to beat your ass down. It either sounds like Nightmare Dystopia Room, or it just reminds me of the fucking Portal franchise. Like, that, it's only got two options. So, you know the bone room? The, the room with the bones. The bone room. The, the What? The old room we used to have in the other portal in. Yes. In the elevator. Yeah. Where did all my chests and- Um, do you want the lore answer or do you want the real answer? I want the real answer because I think I had andesite alloy in there that I could EMC. I can just get you some from the tablet. Oh, I have cool. it in here for myself already. Oh, thank you. And I'm, I'm on it. top, I'm prepared for the- Yeah, because I, I need it for the- I need it for the cog and I literally had my own little workshop down here that had the cog stuff in it. But yeah, the- the- the out of universe non-lore answer is that, um... I thought they were empty when I was de redesigning the furry casino, and turns out they weren't because who the f put chests down there to begin with? 
So, have, have you ever watched... <laughs> so they got destroyed. Have, have you watched the live stream? No. Why would I watch my own live stream? That'd be hell. Yeah, but do you watch your live stream from my POV? <laughs> also, no. I think I spent a solid 15, 30 minutes down there using it as like a, a chest organizing system to mass produce EMC condensers. Oh my god, no, I didn't see any of that. How how else do you think <clears> we, <throat> we, get, we made so many EMC condensers? I spent like so, a solid while doing that. I thought you just like no life turned your brain off to do it. No, no, no. Where the f are you? I have ascended to godhood. Hey, Phil. Oh, you're hey, up Bob. there. Yeah, take my take my fucking alloy. No, I don't want to take your alloy. I've got you're some so, alloy already. Oh, baby, you're so good at taking my alloy. alloy. I'm already full of alloy. You're so good at taking it. Full of alloy. You're so alloy. good. I'm already full of alloy. Oh, little princess. Oh my god. Little bottom bitch. Take my fucking alloy. It's right there. No. You can fit no. more. Come on. Don't you want no, it? No, I can't fit. I'm already stuffed. I've got two <laughs> stacks of alloy. <laughs> well, f you some then you weak. I can't believe you're only, your size is only two stacks. <laughs> Shut the f up. <laughs> Square one, get it because it's Minecraft. Hey Drifter, why do you look I'm visibly mad? I'm going to bludgeon your brain brains all over the workshop floor. Do it, daddy. Ooh. Okay, bend over and I'll hit you <laughs> with the f***ing bat until your skull explodes. Oh my god, that sounds so hot. I've always wanted to explode. I know, right? Oh. Having your brains everywhere is so hot. Oh it's god. like the definition of getting brained, you know? Oh. What the f*** was I trying to make? Oh yeah, brass funnels. I like being an innocent little barker. Come over here, Rudy chan My ass is more dummy thick than yours. Ooh, ah, ah. Come on, get down with the sickness. Ooh, ah, come get it down with the sickness. Or, 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 Okay, so the issue I had last time with these things was that I couldn't uh, specify, or at least with the inscribers, no. what classified as an input and an output. Now, according to this, everything except the back is an input and everything except the right is an output so hopefully it should be able to designate between the input of uh items and the input of fuel uh so if i just stick one of these directly on the side it should just work straight out of the box this time around um i'm not expecting it to because life doesn't like me like that but it is the correct possibility of things that should be happening so i'm gonna give it the benefit of the doubt the doubt was a really long-winded sentence i had 16 brass funnels in this chest already i made six i made 10 more for no reason there's your hang low does it wobble to and fro can you tie it in a knot can you tie it in a bow i need another set of conveyor belts let's set this up to use a chute on top so i might end up having to go inside the walls for this one do not go inside the walls ah, i'm hidden inside the walls i'm a little gremlin guy do not joke. Gooby gooby go you crashed didn't you people live in my walls you, you crashed, do not joke. people you? actually live in there who the f*** would want to live yeah. in your walls? It seems today that all you see are crafting tables and electron tubes on the floor. Oh, where are those oh, where good are those old fashioned old values? Vanilla values. How much we used to roost like lucky as a tubing guy. Here's a walkthrough of the mod. <laughs> Shut the f*** up. We are not going that far back into our history, okay? That was a deep dark stain <laughs> on our history. Remember when, remember when you showed me that and I was like, I'm pretty sure I actually watched the video when I was younger. I, I really hope you didn't. I don't I never want to explain what that is. I just want I just want the fan base <laughs> to suffer as they try and figure out what the mod is. So right now what I'm doing is I'm trying to set up a nice and cool looking conveyor belt shaft set to transfer the uh, non-charged Certus Quartz into the Crusher. But obviously, I need time to think about where all of this should go. Just like you can easily set up a conveyor belt system that can do its job, but you don't just want it to do its job. You also want it to want it cool while it's doing its job, you know? That's like half the fun of the Create mod, making it look cool. Of course, you got to make it look cool and tank your frame rates because of all the cool cogs tips. Exactly. 
<laughs> if your frame rate isn't in the single digits, you're doing something wrong. I'm going to burn the Anadonia server to the ground. I hope you realize this. <laughs> On graduation day, when we finish the fucking series, we can. Graduation day? Why are we bringing up the VTuber I'm leaving because <laughs> I just got sacked video into this? <laughs> Oh no, I have to graduate. I accidentally said on Twitter. Jesus Christ. When we finally finish Anadonia, I'm going to create a copy of the world and I'm just going to let us blow everything up. Like we can we can set off destabilized nuclear reactors across all of the different the sets. How dare you be serious about this? What the fuck? I'm a little goober. I'm a silly little guy. I've never been serious in my life. I like the way that looks so far. Very nice. How am I gonna thread it in though? Because I don't want it to go through the pillars and it can't really go through that wall. Because it's a load bearing wall. Okay, unless I run it through there maybe? No, because that'd be too close to the, to the, to the, to the, um, water mains. I'm gonna have to break it through here. Don't stretch far enough that way. You pissing on Mike right now? You, you pissing right now? You don't, well, it's funny you say that. I have pissed on Mike before. Oh my god, oh my god, you pissing right now. You really do be pissing though. If you were god, would you not be constantly stoned out of your mind? If you were my creation, yes. Okay, hopefully this doesn't tax the system any more than it already is, but I'm gonna try and connect these two together using a mechanical belt. Oh, it's not taxed the system. Okay, so that one's loaded up. That one's ready to fire whenever. Now I've just gotta try and find a way to make this one loaded up and ready to fire whenever. And I think, judging from the way everything is angled, I might be able to plug it in here, but I think that might also stress the system slightly. Nope, didn't stress the system, and it's pulling back. You love to see it to slow as balls, but that's absolutely fine. So, what we need now is we need a splitting mechanic that separates whether or not a crystal a Surtis Quartz Crystal enters the pipeline to become charged Surtis Quartz or if it enters the pipeline to be sent to be crushed. And to do that, we're going to have to create a path outside. Well, I've gotten myself the uh, exit into the outside area. It's a little scuffed, but it otherwise works. Um, so what I've got to do with this area now is I've essentially got to feed it the Surtis Quartz. But in order to do that, I actually need to set up the crafting system for the Surtis Quartz. Batman, won't you find it funny if I find it hello punny? No, it's no longer no against the Pokemon Batman. I'm gonna no, do it, no Joker. Joker, is it an animal? No, Batman, it's Pokemon. You know, a hundred years ago, we used to be considered Pokemon. There used to be no boundaries there at all, Batman. Batman, I'm gonna fuck the little punny Batman. No, no, Joker. I'm gonna Don't do it, Batman. Don't put the little punny. I'm gonna fuck the little punny Batman, and you can't stop me, Batman. Remember, kids, if it sounds true, it probably is. Stay off the internet. Stay on the internet. Captain and Planet. And buy all the mumbo juice you can buy on the internet. The mumbo juice? Okay, this corridor looks ugly as fuck, but it's gonna serve its purpose. We can okay, I've got tidy it up. 17 later. mechanical crafters. That is lit, fam. Bro, suck my and rub my toes. Yeah, someone's been watching Belle Delphine. I wish Belle Delphine's content was that way, what? <laughs> you fucking degenerate. <laughs> you fucking degenerate. Won't somebody please think of the children? Just think of the children. Yeah, I am. That's why I put a 15% off discount on my OnlyFans. If you can prove you're a child or not. Oh on our my shop, god, you get shut off. the f up. Nah, that's foul. Mm, hit it with a thug shaker, Batman. Hit it with a hit it with a gritty. Hit it with a thug shaker. Hit it with a crack me. Batman, Batman, I need you to do a thug shaker, Batman. I need you to flap that fat, flappy badass, Batman. I need you to do it, Batman. I'm begging now. I'm on my knees, Batman. I need you to, I need you to do the Gotham shaker, Batman. Joker, don't piss me off. I've not taken my medication, Joker. Batman. I've not taken my medication, today. Batman. I know you have not taken your medication, Batman, because you can see me, Batman. I'm just a figment of your imagination, Batman. I only appear when you haven't taken Joker, your medication. Joker, I'll kill you. No. I haven't taken my medication. You, you, you can't kill me, Batman. I'm inside your head. I'm inside your head. I'm inside your walls. I'm living in your head rent-free, Batman. Batman, it's rent-free up here. 
I'm increasing your J's, Batman. Yes, Batman, your J's. First I'll crease your J's, then I'll crease your Robins. I'm glad we had this talk, Batman. Okay, so if I connect these up here now, what I think, if it works the way I remember it doing, if I put two brass tunnels side by side, it will work as an auto-sorting machine. So it'll it'll split half and half between both uh, conveyor belts. Spare spare change, Batman. Spare change. I need a single polished rose quartz, Batman. No, Joker. I need them for my mechanical crafters. B Batman, I just need one, Batman. Please, I just, I just need one piece, Batman. Give me the one piece. You know it's real, Batman. The ba Batman. The, the no, one piece. The one piece is not real. The one piece is real, Batman. The one piece is not real. The one piece is real, Batman. I found it inside of my low punny, Batman. Everyone in the city D would be a low punny. Have you not seen them? Fair point, Batman. I completely agree with you. I agree with you. He does things to a person, Batman. Mr. Mime looks the least human out of all of them, and he has a human face. What, what the f*** is wrong with you, Batman? You need, Joker. That's all you need. You just need the face, Joker. Oh. What, what, about, what about the emotional connection, Batman? About the, the, uh, the, the emotional connection. connection. I mean, it's not all about the low punny, Batman. It's, it's not all about the low punny. Joker, when you go That's about a big part like of that, it. do you really care about? What, 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 what would you know about my mouth, Batman? I, I don't know what you mean, Batman. I think you know exactly what I mean, you sick to check with Joker. I've seen one that you do on Rule 34 with Harley. We, we've talked about this, Batman. That, that, that's behind me. That, that was part of my past. That's my history, Batman. You, you can't do this to me, Batman. Please, I'm begging you here. Don't release the don't release my browser history, Batman. I'm gonna dox you, Joker. No, Batman, the don't jump, don't dox me, like. please. I'm gonna dox you, Joker. No, Batman, please I don't. Google, Joker. No, I no, Batman. Google. You're you're making a big mistake, Batman. All I did was criticize your content, Batman. I called you unoriginal, Batman. You you can't you can't dox me for that, Batman. Yes, I can. How dare you assume that reaction videos are not content? <laughs> but they're not content, Batman. They're stealing other people's IPs for your own twisted purposes, Batman. I, I thought you would have been better yes, than this. Yes, but I made the funny face, Joker. I added to it. Batman, you're always making a funny face. You look really <laughs> ugly. You've added nothing to this conversation. You've added nothing to this 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 video, Batman. Do I care? I still get. I still make my bank at the end of the day, Joker. You're diabolical. That's all that's about. You're worse than Capitalism. I am. God, you're worse than I am. That's, you. I can't believe you, Batman. I, I used to, I used to look up to you at least in Seaster, but goddamn, now I just think you're, a, you're a bit of an asshole, Batman. Oh yeah, next time you're gonna tell me that the children in the mines is not a good idea. But I, like, damn, why are they playing Minecraft if they don't yearn for it, you, Joker? You, you've been sending children to the mines, Batman. Anyway, I need you to take this off the conveyor, conveyor belt for a second. I need to make a precision mechanism. No. Okay, okay, I've got enough for you. I've got 126. Wow, that's really impressive. Well done. Yeah, take it. Take my In back. a second, I just need to make a precision mechanism. I hope you realize that that entire 20 minute bit where we just pretended to be the Batman and the Joker, I don't know if we can use any of that. I don't think any of that was coherent whatsoever. Oh, 100%. I, I don't. You know, we're gonna have to review the footage to see if any of it even <laughs> being listened to. <laughs> that genuinely just felt like entering a state of psychosis for like a, a <laughs> solid like minute there. Oh my god, we are like yeah. totally the Joker and Batman brackets. Oh my god. We are mentally ill. <laughs> Never ever say the Joker has a feminine <laughs> again. I will rain hellfire upon you for the rest of time. That is mentally stellaring. Okay, the last thing I need now, the very last thing to make this precision mechanism is uh, a flat bit of brass, I believe. Mechanical press, yes. Yeah, so actually, no, it's gold. I need to flatten some gold. Check out this multi-stage. Please tell me the nightmare is over. Uh, uh, for the most part, for you, yeah, you no longer have to make mechanical crafters. Yay, my brain cells can recover. What the f***? Why is that thing spazzing out? What's happening? The watch isn't even on and it's spazzing out. It's been doing that for doing that. I've just decided not to try and fix it. Yeah, but if this first one isn't working, then I can't make the precision mechanism that is me that that makes the mechanical arm. Well, that sounds like a you <coughs> problem, Batman. It's an us problem. If I can't get this part of the automation done, then there's no way to continue on with the rest of it. I don't know how to fix this.
Try without breaking spending it. money. Try breaking it. Give us some money. I fixed Walk it. Walk me through the steps here. Okay, well, to make a precision what? mechanism, you have to put a... Uh, 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 oh, I thought you took it off the thing then. You have to take no. a golden plate, put it on a conveyor belt, and have it go through the pattern of small cogwheel, big cogwheel, iron nugget, five times in order to make the precision mechanism. And once you've made that precision mechanism, you can use it for two things specifically. One of them is these little scutters over here, these mechanical arms. And the other one is this device over here, which is called a rotational speed controller, which is essentially allows you to speed up the uh, rotational rate of whatever you plug it into. Um, however, you need a strong input in order to be able to speed up the output. So, for example, if you had a billion water wheels, the input would be slow, but because you had a billion of them, you could set it to the maximum speed output and have it go at full speed. Okay, that makes sense. So one of the things I have planned is eventually, once all of this is sorted and we no longer have to stress about doing this, is I want to automate getting all of these individual things set up on their own separate systems with their own uh, rotation speed controllers so that they can all run much quicker and independently of each other because the more things you have plugged into a device the less quick you can make it essentially unless you give it more sources of rotational force like on the input you know what is this thing bottlenecking the hell's bottlenecking this there's a symbol gold here that's clearly what is bottlenecking <clears throat> this like oh it's the it's the chips. There's too many chips. It's made too many. That's what's bottlenecking it. Yeah, and there's not enough, like, uh, what is it called? Um, redstone going down here that uses up the Yeah, chips. but it can't send redstone down there because in order to send redstone down there, it needs to spend redstone, and to spend redstone, it needs more chips. Well, it's so got technically, chips. we have that. We have logic chips. processors. Right here. <clears throat> right? Yeah, it's got too many of them, that's the thing. It's got that many logic processors that it doesn't need to make more, and because it doesn't need to make more, it can't ask for more redstone, and because it can't ask for more redstone, it can't split the redstone down the center to make more of the 1K storage storings. You never thought about putting the two redstone on a separate line? I have, and that's one of the things I want to improve. In fact, if you want to improve it and do that, you're more than welcome to be my guest. How the f***? Which is why I said I was gonna do it later. Ah. Comes from here. <coughs> you okay, bro? Did you steal my precision mechanism? Because it's not on the conveyor belt. Uh, I do not have it in my inventory now. Where the fuck did the precision mechanism go? Where did the precision mechanism go? The thing we just made. Oh. It's not in my inventory. What? I what? Where the hell did that go? It doesn't travel if it pops off the end. I am so confused. Do we have to make it up one of those? We might end up having to, yeah. If it didn't drop, then I don't know what happened to it. Have you got any of the cough medicine that's supposed to help break down mucus? I'm more concerned about where the f my precision mechanism went. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? The true Minecrafter. I'm more bothered about the mechanism than my health. And there we go. That's the precision mechanism. So, so, now that I've got this, I can put it together with a bunch of other stuff and make ourselves another one of the mechanical hands. One whole mechanical hand? Yes, hole. one entire mechanical hand. But for this part, thankfully, we only need one anyway. So, if you can crush me three brass, I can make us the mechanical arm. Okay, I'm going to want to kill you, but I'll do it. Oh, wow, the horror and the pain and the pure effort it takes to drop three pre pieces of brass on the floor. God, you actually glitch kids, you know. Oh my god, shut the fuck up. You are a wee willy winky looking fucking toucher. I like how you can punch me from across the map because the ping is that bad right now. There we go, we've got a mechanical arm now. Give me that, I will attach it to my And I will have a wonderful time. What I need to do is... We're going to take an input from a depot. I forgot to grab the goddamn depot. So the reason we use a depot instead of just telling it to take straight from the conveyor belt is because depots actually provide a really good end cap for conveyor belts. So if they, they're starting to go over their capacity, instead of just popping off, instead, they'll just uh, stop on the belt and they won't accept any more, which is a really good way of do going about it and it also reduces lag.
I don't know how much is connected up to this system, but I don't think it can actually take much more. So I'm going to have to create its own separate system. Ooh, thank you. I'm going to have to create my own separate system to power this. And I think I need a windmill bearing and several sails. I have no clue how to do a single thing with that. Well, then look it up, smart ass. And while you work on that, I'm going to continue this one around here. I don't know how to create the uh, the industrial fibers. You, you don't need industrial fibers for this. What? For the sail, yeah, one more sail. Let me have a look. Sail. You all, all you need is wood and sail frames, and sail frames is just ancient, uh, is just sticks around an andesite alloy. You were looking at the immersive engineering windmill sail. We need the white sail from Create. Windmills are actually one of the best ways to power things in the Create mod. If I turn it this way, and then this way, and then do a little connection there, and then I put this one here, and over here maybe? Like that, and then twist it. That should connect. Uh, it's slightly misaligned, f*** off. That should have it fully aligned now when I do this. And logically speaking, that should just land us on top of the weighted ejector. Although I don't know how I feel about it being a slight drop off. I think after we've gotten stage one of this one done, we're going to call it there for the day. Honestly, I'm a bit, I'm not going to lie, I'm a bit f***ing dead. Alright, yeah, so we got the, uh, the windmill, uh, uh, windmill uh, bearings. You got the windmill bearings? Yep, what else did I need? Uh, just uh, white sails. If you pass me the bearing, I can go get it started to set up. One, <coughs> two, just like up. Oh, rubber banding out my hand. Here is four string. Use it to craft yourself some wool, or actually, no. Take the string, put one in your tablet, take it back out again so that you've got the pattern for string saved, then turn it into wool, then drop that into your tablet. And then take the take out. Thank you. Were you able to follow all of that? Yes. Okay, good. I might be tired, but I'm I'm not. I mean, <laughs> Are you sure? You know, some days I feel like we move closer to God, and then some days I feel like we stray completely in the opposite direction. I think God would be hard. God is hot mm. inside me. <gasps> oh, he's so hot inside of me. He's spilling his New Testament all over my old my Testament. Honestly, I feel bad for those shoters and those certain animes. Why the f*** does that remind you of that now? What? Because I feel completely drained. Oh, shut the f***. What? Femboy rights. Did you just activate the windmill while I was trying to build it? <sighs> Do you think we're going to get mi much wind next to a uh, hill? As far as I'm aware, the strength of a windmill isn't about how uh, you shape it. It's about how many. Um, it's about how many uh, sails you have on it. So you're telling me I could bring, uh, like, build a massive colossal knob and like that would work. Yeah, if you put enough sails on it, and then I've got to plug it in to some part of this contraption. So let's go with this part here. So one, then two. And that's going backwards, so what we've actually got to do, we've got to somewhere along the line, the switch the uh, rotational direction. So let's start right over here. Let's add a set of gearbox here to flip the rotation direction. Can't you make the windmills turn in the other direction? You can, but... Uh, you ideally want them turning the correct way for the sails. And it's easier to just use a gearbox to flip the uh, movement. Now that that one's moving, I need an encased chain drive in order to make the next part move without flipping the rotation direction. So if I grab an encased chain drive from my tablet, and then I can use gearboxes around the outside here, so... One, two, three, four, to get that one moving in the correct direction. Then I need two more uh, encased chain drives right 
here. What we've got to do now, we've got to introduce another set of conveyor belts to actually get the, the essence over here. So what we're going to do is do, we're going to go all the way over to this part here. I think we're going to have to put a funnel, not a funnel, a chute, not a chute, a tunnel. I need more tunnels. God damn it. Actually, you know what? Hold on. For now, let's... I'm not automating this part for now. Hang on. All right, then. Come into my uh, flower power tower. Go up to the very top okay. where the netherite barrels are and grab as much of the quartz essence as you can and then chuck it onto... Um, chuck it into the mechanical crafter on every slot except for the middle one. And then all I've got to do, the final finishing touch, is grab a cover for the mechanical crafter. They've, uh, I, I used them in the uh, tower flower power thing, and I've just got to make one extra one. So I need to make the brass cover, which is just three brass nuggets in a row. Which kind of essence do you need? the Sodus Quartz Essence. And the reason we create a crafter cover slot is because if we're doing a recipe that has a missing thing, this is how it knows how that it's the finished recipe and not that it's waiting for something else, you know? I'm gonna cancel you on Twitter right now. <laughs> no, no, don't cancel me on Twitter, no. Okay, so all around the edge, apart from the middle, right? Uh, yes. Interesting. Honestly, I think I've seen my arthritis ridden Nan do, do things better than this. Yeah, hold on, I'm switching all of the cables around. It'd help if the blocks that I'm breaking wouldn't then instantly reappear the moment I'm, like, trying to right-click something. Oh, yeah. It's been really slow, the slow hasn't it? Yeah. All I've got to do now, all we've got to do now, all we've got to do now is grab some cogwheel, wheel, connect the auto crafter up to the uh, speed, and it should just start burning through it all. Uh, so if we now just grab some cog wheels, there we go. Just give me a bunch of these small ones for now. Let's see. I think if we plug it in, one, two, three, four, five, five, six, seven, and I'm missing one. Are you serious? I'm missing a single cog wheel. Oh come on! Why are you gonna pop off? Don't be a d right. In that case, what we're gonna do? We've got to put an inventory on the side, and then we've got to put a funnel on the side. Let me grab another grab a barrel. And now, as this comes around, it should force round robin split down these two lanes. Here we go. One goes down one lane, one goes down the other lane. One goes into the barrel, the other one keeps moving in the wrong direction for some f***ing reason. Okay, eat my f***. What the f***? One f Every direction is the right direction, my dude. Apparently not, because even though I'm using an even number of gearboxes, it's deciding to go f backwards. There we go, and that should run things, if done correctly, onto the weighted ejector. Do I want to know why two gearboxes just fell out of the sky? No. No, you do not. Yeah, sure. Let me take the redstone off of the f***ing redstone conveyor belt and not the f***ing gearboxes. Did that weighted ejector even go anywhere? Did it land where it needed to? I don't think it did. What did it hit? Oh, I think I know what it hit. It hit me with the two dollar bin. It hit the power cable. So if I try this again, if I throw this on here, and then wait seven f***ing centuries, it'll land it'll the weighted ejector. It'll fire. It'll fire. It will fire. Oh, for God's sake. Get this fucking dirt out of my machine. It just popped off. It did fucking call and popped off. Where did that land? What machine did that fall into? Yeah, now I'm calling this here. I'm gonna okay, and if you enjoyed today's video of Anadonia, then please tell me why, because what the fuck is wrong with wrong? If you did enjoy, leave a like down below. If you have a comment about what you saw in today's episode, then make sure to leave a comment down below. Tell us what that comment is, because we love to read your comments that are comments about our comments.
us. And uh, yeah, if you do enjoy us, our, us, our parodies, and our parodies, witty, our witty, then make sure to, make sure to subscribe below, down below, and be notified we whenever we upload. So yeah, in case I don't see you, good morning, good evening, good, good afternoon, and good night. And from Ruby, bye bye everyone. See you, bye, later, bye, see you bye. later, guys. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye.